Hi friends, I am Shravana and welcome back to my channel Sparkling Future. Before starting with today's topic, I request all of you to subscribe to my channel and also please like, share, comment and hit the bell icon for the latest video notifications. Thank you. So in the previous video, we have seen some hands-on questions. So in today's video, we'll just continue that and see some more. So he, till here, I'll just cover whatever theory, theoretical part we have covered, right? I just wanted to show some hands-on topics for this, okay? So now let's look into the uh, code, how to work on some sample examples. So these are the ones which we, we saw in the previous video. So now, so let's say there is a list, okay? I'm calling that as a list one. And in the previous videos, we have seen how to work with a list as well, right? So now when you have something like this as a list, okay, now if you want some what is there in the fourth position, you will just get it using this uh, in uh, square brace, you will just put it four and you will get the fourth position starting with zero. I mean, this is the index, okay, by passing the index you will get now let's say you have a list like this, okay, one, two. And then inside that again some nested list is there four five again in the inside that again you have a nested list with uh, nine ten and inside that you have something called as hello some string is there so let's say you have a nested a nested list like this then now how are you going to create the instance I mean indexes okay in, uh, to get the uh, how to you create a instance okay, for getting the indexes for, for getting this string out of this nested list okay so now first write uh, like a similar way we will write it from the list to if you take this is the 0th position first position and this entire thing is second position so inside this we have to degrade so now you write to here now 0 1 2 we are already reached here you can actually run this and see that it will return everything clear so now here again we need this hello right so 0 1 again second one is a nested list so again add 2 here then we will reach inside this internal list then again 0 1 2 so let's add 2 2 actually this is another uh, separate list if you see so uh, you will understand when you run this if you see here it will uh, 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 print with the braces so just put zero now you can see you have got whatever you need okay, this is how we will dig up to the uh, index of whatever word you need in a list okay nested list this is how we will work with list okay so normal list operations I have already given in the previous videos uh, you can just uh, go through that please and another example that we saw is let's say uh, there is something split method how to use the split method and all right so let's say there is some something called as now mail id equal to something called shravana at gmail.com let's say there is one email id now you need this string or this string whatever is after or before this at the rates string so now what you will do with that that we will see now so now that that we will see with a simple function okay so now get mail id some something okay and we will pass the mail id to this function so inside this function what we will do is we will return the mail id dot split with at the rate okay and again then you are returning right so now print we will just copy paste this entire thing this mail id means already we have the string here okay so when you run here you will get whatever in a list uh, it will split based on the delimiter that we have given and it will give both sides as separate elements in the list if you want the left side alone then you just give it as zero okay we have to run this it will give only the whatever is in uh, the delimiter we have given right whatever will be present in the left side it you will get that answer and if you want the right side 
then you give this minus 1 ok this is how we will use the split method and if you see here it has returned whatever is after the given at the rate delimiter symbol I mean symbol which is a delimiter in this case so this is how we can create a function for splitting up using one particular um, delimiter and we can get this side or that side values in a list ok so now let us say how to use uh, let us say there is a string ok string now here we have only one delimiter and we have used this method so now let us say you have multiple delimiters so something like uh, India then comma India is my underscore country I am just writing some example ok I love and hash India something ok so now if you see there are multiple uh, delimiters are present so still we, we have to split based on that and create a uh, uh, list means what we have to do we can do we have to import uh, regular expression package and then just say print re dot split inside this split method we can pass now comma and there is a space also right so both we have to um, or to say consider as a delimiter so comma space and r is the uh, symbol we use for adding multiple delimiters in a single split statement so now comma we have considered and we have underscore as well and we have hash as well ok and inside this split itself we have to say on which string we have to perform this operation ok so now this is how we will create the split now let me run and if you see everything here we have not given the space here right because of that reason it, it, it is uh, taking this entire thing as a single element in the list and the remaining like comma we have given so till comma it has considered that as a single element in the list and India is my and then underscore we have given here so after the underscore whatever is there it is giving as uh, another element and the comma and we have given the space the, so that is why after the comma it has split the string and here hash also we have given so for after hash it has converted that as a another list element so this is how we will work with split and let us say you do not know in the string right what all things will come here we know it is comma underscore and hash has come so we will do this so, per suppose you do not know what all things will come right so that time you can use the find all method next let us say you have a string 3 ok so again India India is my and hyphen is also there then hash India hash country and then dollar uh, something rupee etc is there is a string let us say and you have to find out all the parameters I mean all the delimiters that is present in this string then what you have to do is again re dot find all there is a method and here you can just say like r and this one w and single quote and here and plus ok and we have to pass on which string you have to apply this find all and when you execute this it will split so if you notice here all the delimiters after the delimiters it has split using that and it has created a list out of it so this is how we use the split and find all in python ok hope uh, this is useful to you friends thank you for watching the video please subscribe to my channel for more interesting learnings thank you